Hey everybody, the Gaming Guru 51 here, and welcome back to Luigi's Mansion, the Hidden Mansion. In the last episode, we caught a few new boss ghosts, such as the Clockwork Soldiers and Jarvis, and we caught a series of boos that were pretty annoying to catch because they kept moving to different rooms and had a ton of HP. In this episode, since we are on the top of the mansion, it is time to go up this ladder and into a brand new secret area. But of course, as much as I love starting episodes off with luck, there is the final gold mouse in here that can only be gotten in here with a 20% chance. Can we get it? No. So, there is this secret room you can only get to by that ladder and jumping falling down. And the only way out of this room, if I can get my vacuum, is with this mirror. Which means if I want to get this gold mouse to appear, I have to continue leaving the mansion back to the foyer and keep coming all the way back here to find this gold mouse and it's a 20% chance so I'm gonna see you guys when I make that gold mouse appear because I think that's just really dumb and it wastes so much time if you mess it up so I guess I'll see you guys in just a moment finally Holy crap, that took forever to get that final golden mouse of the game. But there you go. 15 minutes later, of course. Because, you know, I have to keep coming back up here all the way back from the beginning. And it was really annoying. But if you check this chest right here. The final speedy spirit of the game, guys. There we go. There he is. We have obtained every gold mouse and speedy spirit. I cannot believe it. Because I figured I would miss at least one. But I'm glad I didn't. So, just a nice little reward there. But now, let's go ahead and check all these chests, because pretty much every single one of them is going to contain money, and that's really cool. So let's go ahead and see what's in here. Some more money. We're going to reach a thousand coins soon. That's fantastic. Is there anything in this lantern? Ooh, nice bills, of course. Bills are always nice. And more bills. Man, hopefully we'll hit a thousand bills. That'd be kind of cool. Do not open this chest if you value your life. Trust me, uh, that's where all the ghosts are going to appear from, and you're going to want to be careful. You don't want to open that chest right away. But instead, I just want to collect a ton of money because this is an optional room, and of course, once you get to this room, the reward is very nice worth your time because money and gold bars and all the various things. I believe there are 50 gold bars in this game, so we're getting fairly close. I may have missed some in the past. So, ooh, another gold bar. Nice. Cool stuff. All right, so let's go ahead and open this chest, which is going to contain every ghost in the existence. And of course, those stupid ghosts always doing the big damage. So we will try to get... Man! All right. Can I, can I, can I please? Thank you. Man! There we go. We'll get you next. Then where are the others? Next is you. And I'll get this heart because health is nice. And I don't want to get punched by this guy, which would be kind of dumb. Come on. Really? 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 All right, because I suck, clearly. All right, there we go. And there we go, guys. And we get ourselves not a green treasure chest with a lot of money, but... A key out of the deal. Now, where is this going to lead us? Well, that means we're going to have to go all the way back up here from the foyer once again. Because, again, there's no way to leave this room aside from this mirror. So, I guess I'll see you guys when we get to the room where this key leads to. See you guys in just a moment. Alright, so as we are coming up to the Area 3 corridor section on the second floor, the key that we're going to be opening with is this door right over here. So let's go ahead and see what's inside. Now, I believe in this room, you're going to want the water element, which you can get by getting this over here. And you can also water this plant, which will give you some money out of the deal. A nice little gold bar. I will take it. But I believe there's also fire elements that you can get, which you're going to need to light up these two candles up here. And you're going to get a bunch of ghosts and a ton of them that try to literally destroy you. So... It'd be nice to absorb three of them at one time, but of course I can't do that today. And I can only get one, which is fine. And there we go. 
And now you need... The, okay, that's why you need water. For these two uh, fire ghosties. So we'll get you. And let's go ahead and burn some water. Or not burn some water. But there we go. And of course, there is a boo in here. I am Bolivia. I hate you. I hate you too, you jerk face McGee. Alright. Now these, uh... These, uh... Uh, fire element ghosts and the water element ghosts can be a pain to catch. Uh, because if you catch those, they're bad. Okay, thank goodness you went back in here. That makes me very happy. 13 HP, we got you. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Whew, nice. 44 out of 50. Alright, let's go ahead and save. And let's go in here. Do not try to wake me. Go away, way. Okay, so I have never ever gotten a gold rank on this ghost before. Because it's hard. I won't wet the bed, I promise. So what you're going to want to do, you need... Well, actually, you need water element. Because you want her to think that she's wetting the bed. Because that's hilarious. Because you're, we are the ultimate trolls. And we are teenagers playing a plank. Playing a plank playing a prank on somebody. So what you're going to want to do, make her water the bed. Because clearly, that's what you do. You got to do this three times. And the reason why I have never been able to gold rank this ghost is because of these things right here. That makes this incredibly challenging. And what I'm going to want to do is I want to absorb them. I don't know if they respawn or not. They very well might. But I want to get them out of the way. Now, if they respawn, that sucks. Well, let's see if I can get the gold rank, because I never bo actually bothered to do that. Come on, can I do it? Can I do it? Oh my goodness, I did it. Holy crap, that's the first time I've ever gold ranked uh, that boss ghost. Uh, we're going to go ahead and check that out first. And this ghost is Sue P, the dozing girl. What a, was meant to be a short nap seems to have turned into eternal rest for the sweet Sue P. That's very upsetting, actually. But there we go, guys. Wow, I've never been able to get a gold rank on that ghost before. I'm very excited to see what the painting turns, or what the painting looks like. But if you leave the room and come back inside, it will re-flip the room. And of course, this treasure chest contains a nice, beautiful silver diamond. Very much worth your time. And you get, I believe, two gold bars out of that as well. So we have 47 out of 50. We are making some serious progress, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, let's go ahead and check this. That's a fine. There's also a plant back there I'm going to want to do a thing with. I am the lovely Bonita. How nice. Come on, we got this. Come on. And nice. Beautiful. 45. And we know that there's two in the cellar. And I can think of where the other ones are. So we are making some serious progress here, guys. All right, let's go ahead and water this plant. Get ourselves a nice little sapphire. Because why the heck not? Sapphires are indeed very welcome in my book. But now that we have done that, you guys, I believe it is time... Well, first of all, there's a mirror in here so I can go back to the foyer. Which will be the fastest way to go. Because we're going to start to go to the basement floor now. Because I said we were going to do that. And, of course, Sue P was in the way. But it is time to head to the basement floor. We could make another chance at catching that one ghost in the uh, rooms to the south of this room. Uh, but I think I'm going to hold that off until later because, again, it's very possible that he'll go into the room uh, that I can't get. So what I'm going to do, this one has 100 HP, so this one may be a little bit easier to catch at first. So let's go ahead and see if I can get rid of all this dust. That way it's not in the way, it's not going to bother me when I'm trying to catch this ghost. And of course, there it is. Boo repeat. No, 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 no. Darn it. All right, well, I hope you go to the room. Please go back to the right, please. Please. Darn it. All right. Well, we're going to want to go into this room at the very least. Because, well, it just makes sense to do that. And this is the pipe room. Uh, this room... I have memories of stupid little green guys. You are a jerk. Alright, come on. 
I have been very bad with my ghost catching skills lately. Stupid ghosties. Alright, now this guy. Oh, there's two of these guys. Okay. And perfect. Got them both. It is a gold bar. Nice. There we go. There is a boo in here, but you're going to also want the power of the ice element to freeze this so we can walk past it, which is nice. And now we're going to go find this boo. No. That's a boo ball. That's not nice. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this because that is what we have to do. I don't know how long this video actually is right now because of all the editing I had to do with finding that gold mouse. So, for all I know, this could be an extremely long video. But I guess you guys wouldn't really mind that too much, now, would you? But of course, there is a key for our troubles. So I will definitely grab that. And that is going to open up to the room to the south of the room that we are in, which is nice because this will allow us to get... Well, first of all, when we complete that room, we can get the boo that's in that one room in the breaker room but here is Buf Buffont 300 HP this guy is going to take an eon to catch so I want to get him as lower down as much as humanly possible that's a lot of HP knocked down so he could go to the left or back to the right and that's fine I guess we'll go ahead and pursue this one since we are able to do so now so I guess I'll see you guys in just a moment when we catch him, I guess. Hmm. Alrighty, guys, so here is this stupid ghost. I believe this will be the time that we catch him, hopefully. And there we go. And now that we have caught him, it is time to catch the other ghost that we need to catch in the breaker room. And then we'll pretty much be good to go. Then we'll just be missing that one ghost, and then we'll be all set here. Here it is, booby hatch. Here we go. So, of course, if I don't catch him here, I will pursue him even further. And I guess that's what I'm going to do once again. Let's do it. Alrighty, guys. Will this be the time that we catch Mr. Booby Hatch? Let's hope so, because I don't want him to escape again. And there we go. Alrighty, 47, guys. We are making some beautiful time right now in terms of these boos. And now it is time to go to what I think is one of my least favorite rooms in the game. Uh, this room can be fairly challenging, depending, and hopefully we don't suck completely, uh, because this boss ghost that we're about to catch is one of the hardest, mm -hmm. I think, to get a gold rank on. So, let's go ahead and go in here. And this is where the uh, two boos that we're missing are, and I know where the last one is, so we should be good to go. Now, is there anything in these crates? And as you can see, there is this guy here. So let's go ahead and check his heart. Darn, I love the cold. I mean, I just plain love it. That's a nice little hint as to something you're going to have to do. But of course, check everywhere. Because it's nice. But you're going to want to light fire here. Because this guy clearly does not like fire in the slightest. Hot. Oh, very hot. You make it so too hot. I'm going to cook you in this heat. I'm going to melt. Did you light these fires? What were you thinking? People who start fires in this mansion had better be ready to pay the price. Now learn your lesson. All right. And of course, you're going to want to avoid because he's going to release a nice little icicle thing. Not the nicest thing in the world. But let's go ahead and put fire on him and then try to catch him. Oh, this is gonna hard because sliding ice is great. Oh, I caught him! Holy crap, I think I got the gold rank. I got, the, I think I got the gold rank on this guy. I really think that I do. Holy whack-a-moles. I think I might have gotten the gold rank on him. That's amazing. I've never gotten the gold rank on him. But of course, this is like my favorite thing to do in the entire game. <laughs> it literally is my favorite thing ever. Alright, so we got two boos to hunt. So let's go ahead and begin the first one. Uh, Boulder Dash. I believe this is the uh, one in, the, in this room that we have to catch. Oh, no, 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 you don't go up there. Actually, up there is not the worst place to be. Uh, but now that all these rooms are lit up down here, it's very easy to catch the final remaining boos in the game, for sure. But, all right, let's go ahead and catch Mr. Boother Dash. If he doesn't escape out of my clutches, which he shouldn't. Okay, he might. He very well. Oh, come on. Really? You have 11. Please don't go to the, to the right. Please. Please. I hate my life. You are the biggest jerk in the history of the world, Mr. Boozer Dash. Alright, there we go. Number 48. Done. 
Alrighty, now for Boo number 49. Let's go ahead and search for his, uh... Well, his... Where his whereabouts, I suppose. I don't know where he is. He could be anywhere lurking in the... The cold shadows, I guess? He could be up here. He could be behind... Okay, he is back there. Yep. Come on, let's get him. And here we go. Boo or Pete, you are mine for the taking, good sir. I appreciate the fight that we just had, but now it is time to be absorbed. There we go. Number 49. We are fantastic right now. And the key that we just got is going to lead up here to the Area 4 boss ghost. You think I'm serious? Or you think I'm kidding? I'm dead serious, guys. This is the Area 4 boss ghost. And with that, I think we're going to make our trip up there to where he is next time. So, with that being said... Oh, actually, by the way, guys, next episode will be the finale of Luigi's Mansion. I'm dead serious. Yeah. We are coming up on the finale already. I'm telling you, this, this LP was very short. Very short and sweet. But I'm very happy with how it turned out. But next time will be the finale as we catch the Area 4 boss ghost and finally pursue King Boo to save our brother. So with that being said, everybody, thank you guys so very much for watching. And I will see you guys next time for some more Luigi's Mansion. Hmm. See you guys then.